Where were we? Ah, uh, yes. Al Haytham told you he's a feeble scholar, did he? <laughs> well, that's a bold faced lie. That's an unexpected English voice. Hmm. So his false modesty was just a facade to hide his true abilities? Absolutely. He doesn't want others knowing his true strength. Well, how strong is he? Stronger than you? Of course not. <laughs> No, I actually ran into him last week while I was in the desert looking for creative inspiration. If he was going out there to study ancient runes anyway, why didn't he travel with me? We could have split the cost. <laughs> well, what is the soundtrack? It's so unexpected. Ooh. This is such an unexpected character demo. It's so different from what I'm used to. What did he turn well, on frankly, his thing? However strong he is or isn't, you just don't want to mess with him. I thought you'd have learned to think before you speak by now. Ugh, we didn't say anything bad. All positive, actually. <laughs> so you didn't drag me out just to play cards? <laughs> we didn't get that far yet. We were just debating how good you'd be in a fight. You keep your cards close to your chest. Not at all. So you don't fight much? Yeah, right. With his temper? I love this, like, more character interaction-driven approach to a character demo. I only need to think. Everything is connected. All I have to do is find the weakest link, deal with the causal factors, and everything else tends to resolve itself. The process of elimination. I'll hit them as a man-spreader confirmed. <laughs> Such a smooth. Essentially, more time on contemplation, less time on execution. Simple, isn't it? <sighs> Not really. Oh, I knew we shouldn't have brought this up with you. I thought my answer was quite engrossing. Boss, this is good wine. I'll have the same, please. I wasn't going to roll for all hate them. But that was very convincing. <laughs> what if at 1.30 a.m. I rolled for all hate them? <laughs> I'm sitting here like we're about to end stream. Like, oh yeah, I really need my beauty sleep. No, no, no. What if I rolled? <laughs> Listen, hear me out. Like, Kaveh can't be without the boyfriend. Like, that would be cruel. I did think about that because I definitely want to have Kaveh. I love Kaveh. I'll hate them, you know, it's a little harder to say. Um, let's hear his Chinese voice first because that's the voice I'm going to have to play him in. And I've heard him plenty in the quest already and it was kind of unremarkable to me, honestly. But let's see, right? Let's see first. Let's, let's watch the Chinese one first. We'll come back for the Japanese and Korean. Oh, I do, I really, I like the Chinese voice a lot. I like Kaveh's Chinese voice a lot, too. He's like more of a whore. <laughs> <laughs> Which I love. <laughs> Affectionate. <laughs> He's like whinier, you know what I mean? <laughs> this is such an unexpected soundtrack, I'm really enjoying it. I didn't expect... It's like the most unique character demo we've seen so far. Yeah, they're playing the TCG. And Kaveh doesn't have cards in front of him, so he's literally just there to shit talk. 
He's like third wheeling the 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 Sino Tignari TCG session just to shit talk his roommate. His animations are so smooth too. I'm I'm getting convinced. The marketing is working, guys. And I mean I'm not saving for anyone else, right? So I love seeing these four together. Seeing these four together is enough to make me regret not rolling for Sino. I didn't roll for Sino. Forgetting to heal every patch, but we think she's gonna be a four star, right? So. Oh no, wait, she's a five star. I, I get the Dendro Kuching criticism, but like, I don't play Kuching, so... I love his animation. I didn't even like him before these demos. Now I'm like, oh, you're kind of cool, actually. Yeah, maybe the reason I didn't like... <sighs> Maybe the, I, I, the part of the reason I've like been so confused, like why does everyone like I'll hate them so much? Like you y'all go off, right? Like enjoy yourselves. I don't really get it. Maybe it's because his Chinese voice actor is like so so restrained that I like there's not a lot of personality there. Uh, playstyle he's Dendro child, aesthetics he's Dendro Christian. Okay, interesting. Interesting. I hear you. I hear you. I hear you. I hear you. What if? 